Welcome to the Sky Path Turbulence Tutorial for Lido M Pilot version 6.7. With this Lido M Pilot release, the Sky Path layer tile will be available in the new Weather Type section, Reports, on the Weather Layers menu when subscribed to by your company. By default, the Sky Path layer tile is disabled and the following message is displayed if no aircraft type is selected on the top bar. To enable the Sky Path layer tile, Tap the Aircraft Type Selection button to display the filter menu. The aircraft types available in the menu depend on your company's configuration. In this example, we will select the aircraft type, Airbus 380, and the selected aircraft type will be displayed on the top bar. Next, tap outside the filter menu to close the menu. Now, select the Weather Layers menu button to display the Weather Layers menu, and the Sky Path layer tile is enabled. Selecting or deselecting the toggle switch allows you to manage the display of polygons within a corridor width of 600 nautical miles centered on the loaded route on the en route map, and within a 30 nautical miles wide corridor centered on the loaded route on the vertical profile window. The report data for sky path turbulence is displayed as white or different shades of purple hexagonal polygons within the corridor on the en route map. The color coding for each severity is shown for reference on the sky path layer tile for quick recognition of the turbulent severity. Furthermore, you can find the range of selected flight levels in which the polygons are displayed, and the date and time the data was last updated. The time is shown in UTC. To access additional information belonging to a specific polygon, long tap on the polygon of interest. This will trigger a window which lists all reports within the tapped area. Selecting a listed report will highlight the relevant polygon on the en route map. Note, if the vertical profile window is displayed, the polygon will be highlighted as well on the vertical profile window. Selecting the info icon will displays the report lookup, which contains information, such as flight level of the report, EDR value, severity and observed time. To close the report lookup window, Tap outside the window. Note, you can also display the report lookup window for a selected polygon from the vertical profile window. The steps to do so are identical to what you have learned earlier. Similar to the filtering process for weather polygons belonging to the weather type, observations and advisories, the polygons for sky path turbulence can be filtered in the same way by using the flight level selector to select the required range of flight levels. Additionally, you can use the time slider to analyze how turbulence reports change over time. This concludes the tutorial. We wish you successful operations with this new functionality in Lido M Pilot.